Today I'll be showing you how to make this wonderful looking masterpiece. Oh. And all you're gonna need for it are a few apps. One, Fonto. Um, two is Cute Cut Pro. Hate that name. And then the third would be Fused. Let's just get right into it now. So first in Fonto, it's a free app. You're gonna wanna hit the camera, you wanna hit plain image, and you wanna grab a white background and you want to hit color then and then you want to hit em go on to the first empty hit the black and go to the second one and hit the white so you get this kind of cool looking effect and then you want to hit apply and then from here you want to use use it and then you want to save this image then what you want to do is you want to actually go back to Fonto and you want to get a white image and I thought it would save but it doesn't save I guess so you got to save it separately so then you want to go to fused and you want to put the background as the white layer and the front the foreground you want to hit choose is this shadow layer and then you want to go to the blend mode and put it all the way on normal you want to put it all the way up and then you want to go to the masking and then you want to grab this this circle the blended circle is right there and you want to drag it up so it's like right around there so the ends just barely touch but the corners are still white so you have a circle and then you want to save this and you want to you can get rid of Fonto then you want to go to this Q cut pro that I don't like the name so much and you're gonna to want to make a new movie make it a square and then once you're inside of there you want to select the photo first and you want to select the circular one then you want to go and you want to find your video and preferably the video is a HD format such as this so it looks like this right now and then you want to click double tap on your, your shade or your um, background layer you want to drag it out drag it past your video okay then drag this cursor back and then tap on your video double tap and then just singular tap on the the second um dot so it jumps right to it double tap on your top layer hit the scissors to split it and drag this to the garbage this makes it the exact same length so you don't have to like guess and drag and everything and then just make sure everything is nudged up against the side so what you have here you can size this up just a little bit more size it up just a little bit more so that the shadows reach a little bit further and then you want to export this to your album so high quality of course and then from there you want to delete that layer and you want to double tap on this and you want to double it and you want to go back and then you want to drag the second one onto the second layer double tap on the bottom layer now so that's the top one and then drag this up make sure it's centered so if you get it off like that if it's off center just hit the undo button and just keep trying until it's nice and centered drag it up like this double tap hit maintain aspect ratio so it looks nice and then you can leave it how this is. I don't like how the scoreboard's in there, so I'm gonna drag it up and drag it down, just like so. And from there, you have your kind of like square video borders, except they're not blurred. And then hit on the volume, take the volume out, so it doesn't double the audio. And then from there, export this as well. And now we're gonna hop on over to Fused. Now here we are inside of Fused, and what you're gonna wanna do is the background, you wanna choose your zoomed in clip. And then for your foreground, you wanna choose your the background white and black layer and then you want to go to the blend mode and you want to put screen all the way up and then you want to go to the dials and take the volume on the top one down to zero and then you can kind of play around with these dials to make it look better this clip doesn't look the greatest because it is a dark clip so it's going to look a little different than other clips that are better looking this is the funnel clip yeah it looks kind of cool because it's just a little bit showing through so that's the effect, guys. I hope you really liked it. Please subscribe, like, and share this video if you liked it. And I look forward to making more.